Hello, World of Tank Blitzers. It's a little finger, and I've got a question for you. What is it about the T25 pilot that you guys just don't like? Um, this is really baffling me. I looked at my stats on it, and you can see here, 29 battles, 80% win rate, 1,864 average damage, accuracy 88% on this tank. And so it got me wondering, because if I go over to the auction right now, this tier eight collector, I mean, premium tank is selling for 3,500 gold. That's a tier eight premium tank. And not only that, less than 500 have sold so far. I just don't get it. I mean, we come over to my stats over here, damage per battle, T25, you can see it's right down here. It's about, you know, definitely the top third of my tanks. Um, looking at it from blitzstars.com, uh, statistically, damage per minute numbers right in line with some of the other American tanks and even the Progetto. Um, good pen, good damage. I, I just don't understand it. I mean, the gun stats here are great, 10 degrees of gun depression. And the most important thing, and the reason I think this tank is kind of special, look at this, terrain resistance of 0.5, which means your effective horsepower per ton on the tank is 33. Uh, th this tank is going to accelerate way faster than any of these other tanks, and it's got 50 kilometers per hour as the top speed. So I went ahead and um, played a battle in it just to, you know, just to see... Um, if it was me, if I'd lost my mind and, you know, so this is just one battle played earlier today, um, top tier on Faust here. This is supremacy. And, uh, as you know, we're going to go up to a, of course, I mean, a good tank like this with the mobility, the gun depression and <laughs> I mean, you just watch the game and watch the battle and I don't understand this tank is going to be selling in 17 hours for 3,000 gold. Um, that, quite honestly, to me, is a steal. And yeah, I get it. There's there's, there's better, more fun tanks out there. Um, but if you're looking for a cheap tank to put in your garage, it's going to make credits. Um, you know, what better tank to do it with than a 3,000 gold tank? We drop two shots into the Skoda. He's going to run away. The T-34 is running away. My only concern is where their TDs are, uh, which they only have one. So we're going to drop on down, and we're going to get in another shot here on the Skoda. And just like that, we're at 800 damage one minute into the battle. He's going to be able to get away before we can reload on that last shot. We've got two caps to one. It's still seven on seven. However, we have put that Skoda on life support for sure. And here we come up. All right, we've got a tier eight a Tiger two in front of us. Can't pen that even with APCR and that damn Skoda. He came back around and uh, got a little bit even with me, but um, I noticed that he is YOLOing in here on the IS. And uh, so we're gonna go ahead and look at this tank move. Um, you know, I, granted, it's American tank. It's it's not super fast, but like I said, 0.5 terrain resistance gonna get up to top speed pretty damn quickly. And there on the move, accurate shot for the kill. And uh, you know, we're just cruising around right now. Smashers coming at us. Yeah, we do have to worry about that tank for sure, uh, especially in the rear. So, um, how do we get away from him? Well, he's behind the building right now, so I think we can crest on over, maybe even try to get a shot here. Missed that shot, um, and now we've got the Rudy. We're not going to let him run away, so pop one into him. Smasher's still coming up the hill here, and, uh, you know, so we've got time to get some shots into him. We can move around when he, before he gets that gun depression down this and we're just going to go ahead and bait a shot here only 300 damage 
know we can get a couple shots in before he reloads so let's be a little bit more aggressive there's a nice max roll we're up to 1875 can we get another shot into him before he gets killed nope he is gone there's only one tank left and object 252 on the other side of the map and hey you know we've got a tank that'll accelerate gets top speed as we drop on down here see how this thing climbs the hill not too too bad now, of course, the terrain resistance is going to help you on acceleration. So here we come on the Object 252. Not sure how that bounced me. It looked like he wasn't even aiming at me. Um, and we're just going to outmaneuver this guy. And yeah, we've crossed over the 2,000 battle mark. And this was just one battle I picked up. We're going to get that second kill. Almost 2,500 damage in the tank. And you guys aren't buying it. I just don't understand it. But yet... Everyone will go out and buy a tier 7 Dracula for 12,000 gold. To me, it doesn't make sense. So the question is, guys, what is it about this tank that you just don't like? Um, and why isn't it selling in the store? All right, leave your comments below and let me know. And if you're new to the channel, please hit that subscribe button. And for those of you that have been longtime subscribers, I really appreciate. And remember to get educated, not fingered, little finger out.